Oh my god, guys, I can't believe this. This stock just came out. I literally didn't even pay attention to this since I made a video last month. Because this stock, uh, this micro strategy stock, just came out uh, last month. Uh, actually, not stock itself. Stock itself has been around for a long time. Um, I'm going to show you the stock itself. But this is uh, Yelmax uh, MSTR Option Income Strategy ETF, which is MSCY. That, that right a cover call. When it came out, I made a video about this uh, ETF and I told you the, the, the holding, what strategy they use. Um, and then uh, I posed a question, is it time for you to buy? If you look at net asset right now, over 6 million for yield max ETF, that's a lot. But the main surprise I'm going to show you today is how much they pay in dividend because this is the first time they actually post the first distribution. So you'll be surprised by how much they've paid. And what's going forward for you as an investor? Should you buy this or should you just stay on the side? You can see here within, um, you know, we can go max. It has double because it only started at $20. Right now is over uh, $43. So it's more than double. Uh, so not only double the money that you're going to get, you know, this time it's a lot. And that will, if you have a bunch of share on this, you will make a lot of money. If you're wondering, uh, should you buy stock itself? I mean, it's very pricey. It's like over a thousand dollars and six hundred right now. All right, it's going to about you know after market it went up twenty. 28 percent i mean one percent so uh that's like one thousand six hundred and thirty uh four so pretty pricey you might as well stick it to uh yale max one because you get in dividend this this is the stock itself uh, that uh mstr or um yale max uh etf rats call on and but you can see this actually does not pay dividends so if you are looking for income then you going to buy this one here before i can show you how much uh, my micro strategy etf has paid for this uh this month uh, first i'm going to just keep you update on this one uh, by the way all the time i bring this type of update on the, this type of etf so if it's your first time and you don't want to miss this type of update and you stay in the loop just make sure you subscribe and if you like this content just uh please uh, give me a like um so if we look at the this is uh, april 3rd which is today uh yell max had announced uh the dividend distribution for a uh, month of uh, april so it's pretty much march but of course it's paid in april right because it has to months has to pass and then they're gonna pay but if we look um i always compare this because if you're an investor who is relying on this type of etfs it's very important for you to know uh, how much they pay you last month versus how much they pay um you know this month i'm I'm actually uh, in, I'm actually uh, creating a, a spreadsheet which you can uh, add all of them together to show you exactly how much you are uh, you are getting and you can kind of average and that way you know how much you're getting because they don't pay uh, sometimes there's a cut sometimes there's increase with these type of ETFs and any type of uh, cover call ETFs so if we look at the Tesla for example there was no uh, difference here between what they pay last month and this month I mean the last month they pay six uh, last month they pay on your on your right hand side is a this is the last month and this one is a current month this is uh so this is um February which they paid in March and this is what you're getting in April so if we look at the and by the way, the dividend distribution date, uh, the dividend distribution date is going to be on uh, April 8th. And uh, you have to be on record on the 5th. And uh, X dividend date is tomorrow. So you just make sure you say in, you stay in the loop so you don't miss this type of updates and you don't miss those dividends whenever they pay. Uh, if you look at the ARC, we can see ARC uh, innovation. It's um, There's no you know much difference there. Um, the one that I saw the biggest difference was, um, if you look at, look at the Apple, for example, it's pretty much the same. Uh, NVIDIA, look at the NVIDIA right now. It paid, it paid at 260 and last month they did pay 262. There's no much difference there, you know. Um, so NVIDIA has been uh, one of the highest paying and I'm going to make a video soon about NVIDIA, how, how much you should invest to make, uh, you know, uh, 5,000, which is a it's gonna be a really good video uh just make sure if you are not a subscriber just make sure to subscribe you can know how to use this strategy to uh, retire early uh if you look at the um, meta look at meta right now Meta did pay one uh one dollar and 17 cents they pay the same so there's no increase there or you know changes um you know the most of these they weren't any uh, big difference you know you can see netflix has increased a little bit from eight yeah, from 72 to 80 so that's eight cents it's uh, significant but it's not a uh, big deal um you know if we look at the coney it's one of the highest paying as well uh, last month they only paid one this one has significant change because last month they paid uh one and 
the one dollar and sixty six cents, which was uh, only seventy four uh, percent uh, of the yield. But look at this month, they paid about two dollars and seventy nine, which was about one hundred and nineteen. So uh, Coinbase um, again with the crypto going crazy. This has always been one of the highest paying ETFs. Uh, we look at the Microsoft and Disney. Those are just kind of you know the normal boring uh, Yale Max ETFs. Uh, Exxon Mobil same boring. JP Morgan and um, you know there's no big difference there. I mean except AMD of course there's a little cut for this month because last month they paid 137. This month they only pay 111. There's a little cut there. Of course AMD is almost like NVDY like Nvidia because of the AI chip. Uh, right so they always have uh, volatile uh, volatility and uh, stock trading uh, higher on these type of etfs uh we we'll look at the paypal it's a 46 and last month they did pay 72 so there's a cut there right so you kind of have to know this thing you know when they pay high you know if you're an investor who relying on this type of dividend so you can adjust your, uh, your 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 expectation of how much you're going to get if we look at the last three we can see square it did pay 63 this month they pay uh 63 and of course last month they pay 65 so there's no much difference there if we look at the Moderna, they did pay uh, $1.13, and this month they pay 78 so there's a cut for this month. We'll look at the AI, right? This is a, this is another stock of uh, Craze AI right now. It did pay a one, uh, $1.06 uh, or 70%. Uh, this month they only pay 60 percent so that they cut about um you know almost uh, 30 cents so those are the things you have to look for and I always keep you updated on these ones uh, again don't forget to subscribe and if you like this content just give me a like uh, so we look at the um, msty or micro strategy last month they didn't pay because it's it came less than a month so there wasn't any uh income generated from that one but guess what not only you've gained massively on the dividend like it has doubled the stock itself but the dividend that they pay look they pay this month about four dollars and 13 cents which is about 120 percent that's a lot of money they're going to pay on the earth so if you're an investor on mstr or micro strategy not only you've doubled your money but also you are getting this four dollars per share that's a lot of money so what's going forward are they going to pay the same as we can see as long as the micro strategy is doing great and there's always this type of option and the volatility they're going to get the money is it guaranteed they're going to pay four dollars all the time uh that's to be seen should you invest in this stock or this etf i won't put too much money on this one because it has double almost so i might have to maybe start a little position again this is not financial advice advice this is just uh my opinion and educational purpose only so till we meet again next video bye bye